Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of the Vodcast Plays Scum. Um, as you can see here, I have a different shirt on than the last time you saw me. That's a trucker jacket. Uh, it just so happens I logged in to do something. I was going to get some screenshots for this, and then I ended up um, just searching the room, and I was like, oh, I like that better. So I just figured I'd start here, and I'd let you, you know, see what I found. Ooh. So today we want to kill a puppet. First, we'll search this room again, because every time you log back in, you are able to, um, you know, everything's been refreshed for you. Piece of paper. I don't need a fucking piece of paper. I'm going to let you guys know right now, a lot of the crafting I'm going to do in this game, I'll show you how to do it the first time, and then the next time, I'm probably just going to turn on the cheats to do it, because it's a lot easier. That's some gloves. Do we have any? Oh, we don't have any gloves. Let's put those gloves on. All right. We won't go upstairs. We won't go so far as to looting everything we looted before. We'll just come downstairs. Let's see what's down here, and then we'll head out. I can't... Oh, those are some shitty pants, but at least... Not being these bright orange ones again. Like I'm saying, that's more more for multiplayer. I mean, in single player, it doesn't really matter. I really don't need any of uh, I'll grab those just in case. We're going to leave the old shoes. We're going to leave this jacket that we're not wearing anymore. Also, there is a... Uh, oh, no. Okay, so it's just the trucker jacket I have. I had found something else. I swear I found something else. Sometimes stuff just pawns in the room. So, let's see, we got a grapefruit, we'll take that, food is always good to find. These you can also bind wounds with, so I'm going to take these because they're in better shape. I don't know that it matters when healing, when you're, you know, doing stuff like that. I'm hungry, well, let's just eat that fucking tomato or grapefruit. Um, yeah, we want to kill today, and I'd like to start crafting a base but we gotta find that base see herbie's whole mission in life here is to find a new home he uh he was dropped off on this island with nothing and no one and he just wants to find a car and a home and a place he can settle down close enough to a town that he can loot when need to or at least a like a base or something all right, I'm not seeing anything. You guys seeing any puppets? Any any zombies out there? No, I'm not seeing much of anything. Do I want to climb that? Can I climb that? I don't think I can climb that. All right, let's go down here. We do need to figure out where north is again. Okay, so north is this way. We wanted to be heading south at the very least. So let's at least turn this way and go this way. The reason why I don't look at a map is because... Okay, I thought I heard something. Uh, I don't like to, to use a map until I found a car. I feel like it, you wouldn't have a map naturally. If you found something that would have a map in it, then it makes sense to have a map. Ooh, a slice of cheese. And gunpowder. You would think I would go for the gunpowder, but I'm not going to go for the gunpowder. Because I never... Oh, beer. I fucking hate beer. I'll drink it, though, in this game. I have yet to see the results. Ooh, he's he's hungry. I'm gonna have to eat this cheese. And I guess we'll eat aloe as well while we're sitting here. So we're gonna continue following the coast until we get to those bridges. I think we are still in the mainland. If I had to guess, I would say A2. Um based on the landscape that I'm seeing. There's another town across there. Man, not being able to check the map is, is a bit of a nightmare. See, if they're inside, it's not a big deal. You can wake them up and they can't get to you. For some reason, the game is built in such a way that they can move real fast, but they, um, they can't go through a window or something like that. I try to avoid soda, not just in the game, but outside of the game as well. Another grapefruit. I could really use a weapon. My weapons suck. The thing is, is that, um, I mean, they'll be just as effective. They just won't last as long. That's a little better. I like the black one. I like the green one too, but. Okay, so these are one of the items in the game that will help. Like if you're indoors and you shoot a shot. Did you hear that? Uh, if you're indoors and you shoot a weapon, it will, um, It'll make it hard to hear. I think I mentioned that before. This is not the best Let's Play I've done so far. 
I know this is super boring. I'm just trying to collect the things I need so that I can survive on the road until we can find Herbie a home. Oh, much better boots. Those are much nicer. Uh, there is a pair of military boots that have storage space in them. And I'll usually just leave a knife in there. These things are cute, but I, I just... I mean, what, do you, what do you guys think? I'll hang on to the hat. And you guys let me know in the comments below. Do you want me to wear nice hats? Or do you want me to wear silly hats? Uh, <laughs> silly hats. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite mask right there. Um, it's the uh, Plague Doctor. I never knew that was a real thing. Like, I thought that was just a weird steampunk thing that kids got into. And But no. Oh, a little whiskey. I tell you what, we will end this episode today drinking that whole bottle of whiskey just to see what happens. All right, we've got water here. And if you have access to water, you should drink the water. Try to try to keep yourself at 100% or even a little bit over. I mean, if you go too far over, I think you throw up. I can't remember what it what the deal is. We could just keep drinking. You want to keep drinking? Just keep drinking. It's not me. It's all zeros and ones. It's Herbie. Herbie's our, uh, our little pin cushion here. Let's see how much water Herbie can drink before he throws up. I'm going to assume he can drink a lot because his bladder is only at 25%, so... I'm not going to sit around there all day. I'm trying something new too, guys. Um, I'm actually running my camera separate. So OBS software is actually capturing the game and not capturing the camera at this point. And it, it's still taking up a shit ton of resources. Although I do assume that's because the game and OBS has to run to be able to capture. It makes sense. Scissors. Nice. Let's turn that bitch on. Put it out here. Oh, that's right. See, that's a fun and interesting thing, that, uh, an option for this game. There we go. Let's get rid of... Let's get rid of you. We'll take the sledgehammer. Um, you can actually set the radio to just static, or you can put radio stations on, because Scum Island is actually a TV show for the people on the mainland. We are just basically here to entertain the folks. We've been arrested and put on this island, and uh, there's a little drone that comes around. I don't think we've seen it yet, or I don't think you've seen it in one of my Let's Plays. And uh, it's basically capturing um, the action. It's pretty neat. But it also can alert players to your location if you're playing in multiplayer. Honestly, I don't know for certain that um, I've ever seen one in multiplayer. I don't play a lot of multiplayer. I don't really like multiplayer. I don't... I like multiplayer in MMOs in the idea that sometimes you have to group up with somebody to accomplish a goal. But other than that, like, I don't mind chatting with my friends when we're playing, but, like, I'd rather just kind of do my own thing. And this is this is definitely one of those games where, like, Unless you're into just, let's go run around and see what's over this hill. You won't be able to enjoy it, I don't think, to the same extent that the uh, developers intended. You know, I hate abandoning that city. I sh I'm sure, you know, I can't leave. I can't leave without at least seeing if there's a car here somewhere. Or a boat. We could take a boat. They just added boats into the game with the latest update, the 0 0.5 update. And I've been waiting for those since uh, right at the beginning, basic. Oh, I think I see a boat. I think I see a boat. I'd rather have a car, but at least I see a boat. I'll get right in the boat. No, that is not a boat. <laughs> or it's a overturned boat. Okay. I don't see any cars. Is it like something you can repair? I don't, I haven't done too much with boats yet. Oh. Nope. Can't interact with it. We could make a boat. Let me see what it takes to make a boat and see if it would be worth it. Okay. Cartridge trap. Yeah, no, no. And the nice thing about recording this separately is I can move myself around so I can show you guys the crafting that I'm doing. Whereas in OBS, it would be like I'd have to stop and do things. All right. So I think you need a paddle. So paddle is nails and boards and... Okay. All right. Yeah. Fuck that. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't like to go in the water just because I'm afraid of water. <laughs> and I like to play the character like I, like he's me. It's not, though. It's Herbie. Not really Herbie. Not my friend Herbie. It's named after him. But, um, you know, I didn't convert Herbie into zeros and ones and, and upload him into my computer. <laughs> he's still with us to this day. <laughs> okay. 
Really wish I knew where I was in the world. If I could use a map, that would be totally fucking awesome. If you guys want me to use a map in the next video and I haven't found a car, then let me know in the comments below and I will just start using a map because we will make much more progress in this game if I can figure out exactly where I am, where the nearest town is, where the nearest, you know, military base is so I can get some weapons. You know what I'm saying. I need to shut up sometimes. I've got this. Hang on. You know what? All right. That's better. Got to put a little bit more game in the can, as they say. In the biz. In the biz. So far, this has been about 12 minutes of nothing, and I apologize. Like, I'm really trying to get somewhere. Okay. Okay. Hang on. There's got to be docks or something. All right. I'm going to blow out his energy here. Hopefully he doesn't fall and get hurt. Ooh, that was close. You can really twist an ankle real easy. I was hoping somewhere along the coast we would find a boat at least. But we've had no luck thus far. Ah, oh, shit. We are heading north again. How did that happen? And I'm hungry. God damn. Well, it's because I'm running around like a jackass. Let me eat this. I guess we'll go back and get... Um... Wait, what is that? There's something down there. But I came from that way. Alright, we're gonna head there. At least if I can get to a boat. At least if I can get to some kind of a vehicle. Oh, that's what I was afraid of. I flew a little too close to the sun. Alright, let's patch ourselves up here. Uh, another thing, if you guys ever decide to play this, is watching your gear weight. See, I'm at 49%. But if I start running, I'm over. And it doesn't take much to push you over. I'm going to have to stop running because... It's killing my energy. <laughs> That's my excuse in real life, too. IRL. Oh, God. Unless something exciting happens, I'm just going to go ahead and cut to when I get to the end over there. I, um, I just wanted to stop along this run here. Look how turbulent the ocean is there. It's still not perfect, but it looks pretty damn good. I wish they would add an undertow, because look at I can come out to here. Wait a minute. Hang on. Oh, there we go. Okay. You can actually swim in this game. I usually don't. Now, normally holding spacebar will get you to the surface, but I must have too much weight. Although, now, <laughs> hey, uh, game pyres, it's a little glitchy right there. Look at my energy just depleting. It's, it's sad. This is why you'd never swim. Man, this is so weird, because, like, I should be out of the water right now. I am so confused as to what is happening. Just get out! Oh, thank Christ. All right, he's tired. All right. We did not get to the end there, so I didn't cut to anything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up a little camp right here. I'm going to have something to eat for the night. And then, um, okay, guys, so I went all, I went all the way around the coast and realized that I just did a giant circle. So I'm not going <laughs> to, I'm not going to bore you with all the details. I'm just going to run through the forest at top speed until I can't run anymore and hope that I don't run into anything. Um, it's too distracting when you're trying to head in a direction, all of a sudden you see a little town or a city and you're like, oh, I should probably go there, they may have some stuff I could use. Uh, or you come across a road. See, these are the decisions you make. In, 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 a, in a real survival situation, I would imagine too. If you've been out in the woods for, you know, days maybe at that point and you come across a road that that's like your salvation you should probably stick with the road uh just seems like common sense to me however this is a game and i want to get where the fuck i need to go <laughs> without spending all day trying to get there it's also making this fun and enjoyable for you guys all right we've got a house here we're gonna have to stop at this house because it's right along the way Oh, there's something up there, too. All right, we'll check this stuff out before we head 
further south. Perhaps we'll wrap up. Uh oh. I definitely heard one. I don't know if it was that one or not, though, so I'm going to sneak in here for just a minute. Actually, I do need to rest pretty bad, too. Uh, okay. Let's lie down. Let's have a little rest for a moment. At least we made it to a house without being attacked. All right, I'm going to go kill that thing. I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Now, I'm not taking any damage from these things, so keep that in mind. Because I am terrible at these games. So, in most cases, you know, getting by it is probably better than fighting it. Although you do get more um, fame points, you know, killing them than letting them go. Uh... Oh, a pickaxe. We got a repair kit and we've got some fish bait. Excellent. We'll have to get a. God, I can hear him. He's like right outside. Oh, yeah, he knows I'm here. When they start making those kind of noises. And the bad thing about that also is. He's probably going to bring some friends. There he is. OK, so I know where he is roughly. The nice thing about these little stalls is they can't get into these stalls, but I can probably lure him around to the point where I can just bash his goddamn head in. Hey, there you are. Can I hit you from here? I got a bad feeling I can't. <laughs> it looks like I can clip through the fence. Hey, 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 <laughs> I'm over here. All right, that's it. Herbie's had enough. Take this, you rotten son of a bitch. Uh, see, I would have taken a hit right there. So what you're supposed to do, there, there's a pattern to all of them. And when they kind of lunge forward, that's when you get them. Uh, so we, we can search this one so you can see what it looks like when you search a dead zombie. But really, none of this is useful. Look at the condition everything's in. I can't use any of that. Oh, well. Well, uh, okay, let's head up to this tower. We'll drink our whiskey, see what happens, and then we'll call it an episode. <laughs> I'm sorry this one wasn't super exciting. At least we accomplished the one goal I had set in the last video, and that was to kill a zombie. Are you guys bummed out that I don't take damage from zombies? I just... Those are wolves. Here. Oh, that's cool. Oftentimes up here, you'll find a gun or weapons there. Oh, salvation is mine because I got a giant fucking backpack. But now I got to take all this shit and move it over. I don't want that. Okay. What is that? That looks like there's something right there, does it not? It's a flare cartridge, but it's not showing up on the screen. That's weird. Huh. I wonder if that's something new they're doing. All right. Let's take a... Let's, let's build a fire up here. Or let's... Can I build a fire up here? I don't know if I can build a fire up here. We're going to try to build a fire real quick. And then we'll drink some whiskey and call it a night. Okay. Let's search while we're here. Da, da, what can I cut down? Can I cut you down? I can cut this tree down. Let's just hope there's no zombies nearby. I never play this game with headphones on. I always just play it with my, you know, 5.1. And the spatial sound is really good. Like, I'm, I'm hearing that wolf coming from over there. It's definitely not anywhere else other than over there. All right, what do we got? We got some... Oh, my God, we just end up with logs. We can do planks. We don't need this. We need... We need to cut a bush. Can I cut this? I can cut it. Now, we're just going to make a simple fire, I think. Let's see, there's three different fires. There's a bonfire, which actually, you know, we do have logs and we do have this. We would need five long wooden sticks. Do we have, that's a small one. So let's take this one and go back to these logs and drop it over here. What is this? Can I do anything? Let's chop that tree branch. I'm not sure what cutting those into does. I'm hoping it creates long sticks because if we can get 
How many do we need? Five? Five and five logs. We've got four logs. We just cut down one more tree. We could actually get a bonfire. I don't know if we need a bonfire, though. That's a little ridiculous. Okay. One, two, three, four long sticks. Let's cut this down. It's very convenient when stuff like this happens and there's like bushes right next to each other because trying to carry long sticks is a nightmare because you can only carry two on your back and I think like one in your hand. But that doesn't really help. All right, you know what? I just, I don't like, this is getting dark. We could do this, we could do this. Can we do that one? Oh. It must be because there's stones in the area? I don't know. Oh, I can craft it, but I can't fill it. That's right. All right, let's do this one. I don't know that I can... I see, I have to be up there. Okay, well, let's just... Let's just build a bonfire. <laughs> I think we can fill this. Where can we build it? We need it near these logs. Okay, that's good enough. Oh, I need gunpowder. Suck my ass. I still need gunpowder. Don't I? Have, I don't have any lighters or matches. Okay, so oh my god, look at how beautiful that is. This game is absolutely gorgeous. It is. Oh wait a minute, I did not want to do that. <laughs> what did I drop? Okay, no, I did. Okay. You know what? For you guys, I'm going to go run around real quick. I'm going to grab a bunch of rocks, and I'm going to build a fire up here, okay? All right, here we are, guys. I've got a fire going, so at least tonight we'll be nice and warm. We've got a, a roof over our head. I just wanted to take a look out here again, though. Look at that. All of that is ours to explore. This is Herbie's world, and he can go wherever he wants. So next episode, I'm going to stop at nothing until I can try to find some kind of a vehicle, whether it be a boat. Oh, a cargo drop has been deployed. I'll show you that in the next game, the cargo drops. Uh, let me see. Okay, so A1. We know we're in A1 now. So that's a good thing. Kind of. I don't know if the ones go or... It doesn't matter. Okay, let's sit and have a drink, and then we will call it a night. Da, 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 da. It would be nice to have a bed or something up here, but... I don't really have the time to do that. Let's get rid of these because we're not going to use those. And what am I doing? That's what we're doing. We're going to drink all this whiskey. <laughs> Ten servings. Drink all. I've never done this before. This is, I mean, my bladder is already super full, so I'm probably going to have to pee. But I imagine drinking a whole bottle of whiskey in this game, if it has any effect on your senses or anything, it will. Those wolves are really freaking me out, by the way. All right, and there it goes. So I imagine a few things it would do, like, you know, walking seems like that should have affected your walking. Uh, and on top of that, um, I would think your health. I think it would do things to your health that's not great. Our calorie intake is going up, 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 up. Our bladder is super full. Okay. Well, you know what that means. Packing up my tent now, and I'm pissing on the fire. Oh, yeah. You like that fire? Okay. If you guys are loving watching these as much as I'm loving playing them, please consider smashing that like button, commenting, subscribing, sharing, and hit the little bell icon to let you know every time I put out a new video. Uh, you guys take care of each other out there, and don't forget to make somebody smile today. I'll catch you guys in the next episode of the podcast. Plays a scum. Take care. Boy, howdy. <laughs>